New tonight, a city council vote will make it easier for you to buy beer at the two food halls that are coming to Knoxville. The Kearns Food Hall and the Marble City Market are both under construction right now. Tan News reporter Vinay Simlot toured both sites and tells us how they'll look. Vinay. Robin, this is a food hall. You can see it behind me. Many different restaurants, retailers and stalls like you see over here, and then big sitting areas in the middle. On Tuesday night, the city council unanimously approved an ordinance to let each individual restaurant sell beer. A win-win across the board. With two food halls coming to Knoxville, City Council Member Andrew Roberto says he wanted to make sure all of the restaurants inside could serve their own liquor. We've seen it in other cities. We wanted to have those same opportunities here in Knoxville. Food halls have grown in cities like Atlanta, Dallas, Denver, and Minneapolis. You could want one item and I can want another, and a friend could want an adult beverage, and we can all have it in one same place and be together and gather. Tino Cartwright works for the Marble City Market. They're building a food hall on Regis Square. Each of these booths will be separate restaurants. And across the Henley Street Bridge, Tim Martin is helping turn the old Kearns Bakery into a food hall. Uh, the plan for Kearns in the food hall is to have a, a unique environment with uh, multiple different uh, local uh, artisan chefs. The building will keep the character from the bakery with the same architecture and the original silos. So you can get together with your friends or your family, uh, even your dogs. And both food halls are excited that the city's embracing them. The forward thinking of the city of Knoxville to elevate the experience again that we already have. You know, if you want to try a uh, a, uh, you know, a Japanese beer or a Mexican beer or some type of different type of beer, you'll be allowed to do that. Now the Marble City Market expects to be open by the end of this summer. Kearns Food Hall plans to be open by next year. The beer ordinance has to go through one more city council vote before it's fully approved, Robin. Those are going to be great spaces. All right, Vinay, thank you.